In this lecture, we'll be starting with Canvas overview and in the upcoming lectures, we'll see how we can make use of Canvas API to draw within the Canvas element. So, Canvas is a new element in HTML5 and the Canvas 2D API is basically defined in a separate specification. So, the 2D API is not part of the HTML5 specification. It has been defined in a separate one. The Canvas API is used to draw within the canvas element and this is possible by making use of methods that are available. And this canvas was actually developed by Apple as part of the OSX dashboard. Currently it is supported by all the major browsers. So if I have to say how we can make use of canvas element in our HTML web pages, that will be something like this, where we have the canvas element identified using an ID and then we have width and height attribute and we are then closing the canvas tag. Whatever content you will be writing over here inside the canvas will be treated as a fallback content and it will be only shown to the user if canvas element is not supported by that browser. So let me show you how this is going to look on the web page. Currently, we don't have anything inside it, so the page will be obviously blank. But I would like to show you the width and height parameters that it's going to take. So here you can see that the width and height of the canvas tag that we have defined. So width is 500 pixels and height is 700. Now when you specify this, these are treated as X and Y coordinates and the default starting position is obviously taken from the start of the screen that is over here. If you see where my mouse is pointing right now, 0, 0. So from there, 500 and then height from there below. So if you have any positive values defined in the height, that will go from 0 to bottom side and negative values will go up. So this is how the canvas element draws its areas when you specify the width and height parameter. Now we can also draw using canvas API inside the canvas element and that is by making use of the methods that are available for drawing. That is begin path, fill rect, fill style, move to, line to, close path. We'll be making use of some of these methods to demonstrate how we can draw within a canvas element using this Canvas API in upcoming lectures.